to what the kids be saying. I am your host, Esther Brunat, and this is your source for behind the curve pop culture knowledge. Brought to you straight from the high school teacher's classroom. You are in the right place if you are not hip, want to be hip to the times, are hip and want a good cringe, still use the word hip in any way, shape, or form. On today's episode, we will be talking about securing the bag and flex. Dictionary defines securing the bag as anything you want or desire that you must obtain or accomplish your goal. And usually the bag is money. So the other day I'm using this website called WouldYouRatherMath.com that I use a lot in my classroom. And what happens is I give the kids an option or two options I should say and they have to choose between those two options. They usually have to give me some kind of mathematical reasoning as to why they chose option A or option B but usually I just end up hearing lots of opinions. But I digress. On this particular day I asked my students would they rather a bag full of pennies that weighs the same amount as them or a stack full of quarters as tall as them? And for some reason, my students could not get over the idea of carrying around a bag full of pennies. It had nothing to do with how much money they would get if it was full of pennies, but everything to do with, oh my gosh, what if they fall out? Oh my gosh, what if I can't carry it? Oh my gosh, na 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 na. To which I was like, if you're afraid of the money falling out and you're afraid you can't get a good handle on it, sis, secure the bag unintended see what I did there this term is most properly used when somebody is going after something so if you see a young kid at the grocery bagging some groceries if you see a young kid studying and doing what they're supposed to be doing say hey secure that bag or I see you securing that bag let them know that they're on the right track next up is a flex usually People refer to the term flex as when you're trying to flex your muscles, non-existent. Urban Dictionary defines flex as showing off your valuables in a non-humble way. Because you know when people are trying to show off their muscles, it's usually unnecessary. The other day, I offered my students the opportunity to do one of the questions in class up on the board. So one of my students jumps at the opportunity to go up to the board and he solves the problem flawlessly. He's done with the question and he keeps writing on the board and I'm like, yo, my dude, what are you doing? And he starts to tell me that he's checking his answer. But while he's checking his answer, he starts to confuse himself and change the right answer that was up on the board. To which I said, sir, please take several seats because you up here trying to flex and now you're getting it wrong. Example number two. The other day, one of my students was trying to explain to me that he messed up his cell phone um, over the last weekend. And I was like, well, I was trying to text you guys on Remind to remind you that you had some assignments. And I was like, very confused because he had an AirPod in. And I was like, sir, if your cell phone is broken, what are those AirPods connected to? And he was like, not a dang thing. Ladies and gentlemen, that is a flex. That'll do it for this episode of What the Kids Be Saying. As usual, this has been brought to you by Esther Brunat. If at any point anyone else would like to brought to you an episode, holla at your girl. For now, stay hit, my friends.